Hello guys and welcome down to this Ride Sims 2 live stream. Today I am joined by Aaron from the Rita channel. Same as last week. Hello, Pog Vibes. <laughs> so yeah, he's uh he he's he keeps saying part vibes, so just yeah, part vibes in the chat be great. Obviously part vibes, vibes uh, started today at, at Thorpe. <laughs> yeah, interesting idea. Um, how is everyone in the chat? Hope you're doing well. And welcome to Vampire. Welcome to Transylvania. Well, you know, that's where Vampire is. Um, it this is this is an old sim. I did put out a uh, a vote on Twitter, and you guys voted for Vampire. So uh, yeah, there you go. <laughs> Aaron, given the people, in. yeah, given the people what they want, not what they need. How's the panel? <clears throat> The panel's great. I've I've still not fixed it, but I I will I will be fixing it. Um, I'll be using the touchscreen controls tonight. Um, but yeah, I need to get this ride operating. We've got a lot of people in the queue line, a lot. Yes, it looks cool, doesn't it? This sim. Yeah, I don't know what. There's the music. I thought the music had just died. There it is. <laughs> Welcome to Transylvania. Pop vibes. Pop vibes. Yes. Guys, do do me a favor, go and subscribe to Aaron's channel, link is in the video description below, and also, share this video around, and smash like, like you're operating vampire. Yes, because why not? Because why not indeed? It's only the price of two lads, no, no, I'm getting confused now. <laughs> not this again, don't get confused again. <laughs> no. <laughs> so I hope everyone's up doing well in the chat, if you've got any questions, please do fire away. Um, Hello to Merlin Mavericks. Had a great time on your a great time. Okay, Granville. Had a great time on your podcast last night. That was fun. Uh, it was me, Deck, Emily, and Tasha. It was fun. I'm oh. going to add a train. There it goes. That was yeah. That was fun. Uh, this was my first major coaster. Nice. Nice. Good stuff. Yeah, it's a good ride. Hmm. <clears throat> To tell you a secret. Um, yes. I've never experienced this before. <gasps> what? You've never, never been, been on vampire. vampire. Oh no. my! I've never, I've never been to Chessington. Wow! Wow! <laughs> that will change very soon. <laughs> what do I think of the new merch from Fart Vibes? Um, yeah, it's great. It's good. It's on brand, isn't it? Does someone just call me a weirdo? <laughs> weirdo? That is, <laughs> you can't that is call correct. People weird. <laughs> that is correct. But for that, go in there, go and subscribe to the Reed Channel Horror Story Times. Thank you very much. <laughs> oh, Aaron, right? Just, just lay the information down for people who don't know. You're not from the south, <laughs> so it's not easy to get down there, is it? It's not a place you can get to. And when you go down south, when you live up north, it's usually to farm. Well. I grew up very, very, very close to Alton Towers, so I have so many memories of towers. Just a touch. Sorry. Very loud. Yeah, I usually am, to be honest. Yeah, so I grew up really close to Alton Towers, so that was my local park, but there I never go. got down to Chessington. <clears throat> In fact, I went to Thorpe for the first time very recently as well. Yeah. Um, and what did you. So, like, have you ever been to Legoland then? No? No, never been to Legoland. No, I've I've actually never been to Legoland. So the 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 additions that they've had for the last couple of years, like Mythica, you know, and all that stuff, and Jago and all that, I'm really looking forward to it. It's um, I'm 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 really I'm looking forward to it more. Why can I hear the chain lift like a lot on this sim <laughs> when I'm in the station? We should anyway, go to Legoland. We should. Um, maybe maybe we should um, try and get Chessington in as well as um. Legoland when we go down. Maybe stay an extra day. Yeah, get, why get not? Done. Because yeah. we're at the shark cabins anyway, so it's not that far from Legoland. That's no, not a stretch. Yeah. Let's do this. Let's, Let's do, do this. it. Let's do this. Hey, Coast Dan. Hope you're doing well. Hope the off the tracks crew are sorted. Uh, Rifle's in the chat. Hello, Tom. Uh, we've got. Adrian, we've got uh, Mavericks, we've got Astute, yeah, Astute, and uh, we've got uh, Shalem, Shalem Dent, we've got Jess, we have Enrita Channel, we've got Carl, 
Yes, the Breeze Channel. <laughs> Legoland is good. Just have your walking boots on. Yeah, I mean, going going to any park, um, really these days. You you know you because because uh, because of, cause of um, the plague. Like some of the things aren't running that get you around places properly. So yeah, you've got to walk a lot. Be used to it. Be used to it. I go to towers a lot. All I do is walk there. Yeah, towers is just. It's just a glorified hike. <laughs> <laughs> it's literally the, the only excuse for exercise I have. I'm going to towers to exercise and going to. Uh, yeah, to some I mean, like. The, yeah, so, like, uh, what, what I mean by that is, like, the, the sky ride and stuff, you have to have your own. Uh, your own gondola. You have to, you know, and in the monorail, you have to be on your own as well with your group. So it does slow things down a little bit. So it's sometimes easier just to walk, isn't it? Yeah, massively. Like you say, especially if there's a lot of people on their own, obviously, going on the, the gondolas. Um, yeah, yeah, it slows things massively down. Samuel Costello! Oh my god, he's wow. here. Wow, he's, he's here. Hello. Loki, have you returned from the, uh, the TVA? And that, have you grown your hair back yet? Yeah, I hope you're doing well, mate. I've not heard of you for a while. Yeah. How's things? Yeah, hope you're doing well. Vampire. <clears throat> when we go towers, we clock up 3,000 steps always. Yeah, it's easy to do. It's so easy. Especially if you like to leg it. If you, if you, oh, 30,000. Yeah. As yeah, as, that's uh, a lot. If you, if you leg it to... Um, if you leg it to Nemesis at the start of the day from the main entrance, that is a, that is a long walk. If you go from one side of the valley to the next, like from the towers themselves to Nemesis, that's the walk. Yeah, it is. It really that's is. That's the one. Yeah. <laughs> it's going back up the other side, trying to like, you know, go fast as well, running up. That's a killer, that is. It is. I feel like they've... Um turned the music slightly down on this uh, sim. It used to just be the organ constantly playing, but it feels like it's mm. not. <clears throat> oh no. Yeah, so um, purchased something for the channel today, which is really exciting. Um, I bought myself a new lens for my camera. So Yay. that's going to be very fun to play with. Um, it's one of the better ones as well. It's something that I wouldn't usually buy, but with the, the Amazon... Uh, Prime Day deals that are on at the moment. If you're thinking about like getting a camera to do vlogs or for your channel, or you know, you're thinking about getting that microphone that's a little bit better, you know, Prime Day the deals today are nuts. <laughs> they are absolutely crazy. So check them mm. out. Honestly, it's worth checking out. Everyone's going nuts for the deals. Yeah, guys, do me a favor, smash that thumbs up on this video that would be awesome give us a like and give us a subscribe if you're not subscribed already um, we have our brand new merch launch on uh, July the 1st as well yes yeah, so um, uh, Danny I do have a GoPro at the moment uh, but I have a Sony A as well um, that I don't use but because I've never really like using it the lens that I have for that is crap so um, yeah, I bought a new lens for it, so I'm going to use it in my Sony now um, to get some really nice shots, which I'm happy with. Nice. Of Rita, of course. Yes, of Rita. Yeah. In all her glory. I better Obviously, let Fast Track on. We've got 60 people in Fast Track. Wow, you oversold them. Yes, just a tad. <laughs> just a tiny bit. But yeah, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to be shooting my intros and my outros on my Sony and bits in between and stuff. And then, uh, yeah, I'll be running and gunning with the GoPro always. It's just such an easy thing to vlog with. It really is. It is, isn't it? The GoPro. Yeah. And you don't have to be too, um, I mean, you can like, you know, if you did drop it, so, say, you know, obviously you won't mean to, but uh, it seems yeah. more robust. Yeah. And like, because it's on that little handle thing that I use as well, like when I just go, oh, Aaron, just yeah. hold this a minute, just film this a sec. It's just <laughs> really easy, isn't it? And I tried to go all day with Attenborough with it. And here they are now, refreshing refill. Joe is going yeah. for the Peach Fanta. Here's Luke in his <laughs> natural environment. <laughs> yes, in the refreshing refill. <laughs> <laughs> oh, apparently, uh, Danielle messaged me yesterday. She went into town 
uh, near us, and apparently the candy cabin shop where I usually Whoa. get my peach fanta from, they've got it back in stock. So how much are we talking? That like how is it like ten pound a can now? Is no, that what it's what it was like one pound twenty a can, which is Jeez, not bad. Right. Okay, I'm gonna send you one pound twenty. <laughs> Don't send it on here. For the YouTube will take it. Send it me after the stream. I'm sending you several peaches, every peach as I can. <laughs> Why are your trains running so fast when I got vampire? It's so trains so slow. Um, you have to time the um, you have to time the dispatches with vampire. It's very finicky, and if it gets too rudely interrupted by a motorbike, sorry about that. If um, if it gets to the second lift till too quick and you while well, you dispatch too quick it'll it'll shower you um yeah but i do feel like this sim uh, feels it does feel faster you're not wrong um definitely hey jake hope you're doing well so who's been out to park vibes or who's getting out to park vibes um, park vibes park vibes park vibes hi jake park vibes any news on your Florida trip? Yeah, um, at the moment, still, still, still a go. Um, June, June twenty, June, June twenty twenty two. Um, wait, what are we in now? Twenty one. Yeah, yeah. Ne next year, June. That's when we're going. Um, just have to see. Um, I will be fully vaccinated by then. So, wow. yeah, hopefully, Danielle's already fully vaccinated. So, nice. Yeah. Just... Hey, Lissat, how's it going? Hope you're doing well. Hello. Can't wait for part vibes. Merlin Mavic's drinking ground. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, legit. Yeah, legit. I'm having my second vaccination on the first, then part vibes on the second and nice. third. Oh, I'll close to main queue. I don't think I'm going to go free train ops. There's no need. But yeah, so um, we just had one of our reviews come back in from one of our web website writers today on the Smiler. Um, it's absolutely incredible. Um, so I can't wait for you guys to see that. July the 1st, a new website will launch with the new Teespring store um, for the merch. It's going to be awesome. I can't wait for you guys to see everything that's been going on. And I can't wait nice. to get out there and take some new photos now of this new lens. It's giving me a new, like... New, new inspiration <laughs> yeah to, do it to, yeah like i can't wait to capture the same photos i've captured on about 700 different cameras in the last no no years. no try try them different viewpoints that's what you want you, you can't I, I physically can't I physically you can. can yes you can we will do this this is how it is this is the way this is the way this is the way how's the new unreal engine beta that's a good question um it's it's a bit <laughs> it's a bit iffy it's literally an early access version. It's not. It's not very ready, um, like at all. It it looks beautiful. It looks stunning, um, but yeah, there's so many bugs right now. They need to iron out before they uh, make it a full release. But I hope they do, and I'm sure they will do. I had a ride host for Vampire tell me to tell me the block set up on Discord. Lol. <laughs> cool. That's crazy. Um, yeah, so you saying it's not the same as people think. It's not the same as ride sims. No, is it? Heck? No, this is this is just um, this is complicated. Don't get me wrong. Uh, breakdown detective. That means guys in the chat. Pablo. We need Pablo. We need. Pablo. Oh no. Pablo, don't be kicking just, it. Just kick it. Looks like the block zone needs to restart, reactivate the blocks. Okay, let's do that. <laughs> pre-lift 2. Of course it's pre-lift 2. It's always pre-lift 2. This is what I was saying before. It gets very finicky if you go too far. I tell you, just go and kick it. No, you can't kick a vampire. He'll bite you. Yeah, they can try. I've got garlic, man. Hey, Adam. Hope you're doing well. <clears throat> Pablo. I'm just going to share this on Twitter really quickly. I feel like everyone's yeah. like at five aside or something. <laughs> I, I feel like all these rides are harder in real life though. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> yeah. Obviously. <laughs> yeah, they will be, yeah. It's, it's, it's a lot harder in real life <laughs> Yes. Yes. That is yes. the way. That is the way. Um, 
<laughs> oh my god, the main queue is 140 people in right now. This is ridiculous. This mm. is like peak Saturday afternoon at Chessington. What's fast track? One minute. 24 at the moment, 26 now. I'm going to put some fast track people on. That's right. I just wonder why they didn't make a sim for the Professor Burt version. Well, they haven't done it yet. Um, let, drop your suggestions in the comments, as always, on any of our Ride Sims videos. Please do drop suggestions in the comments um, as we go through them all, and Ride Sims go through them all as well. Mm. But yeah, that would be a great sim. That would be fantastic. Bubble works. Yeah, Bubble Works, I, I, it's still pretty controver controversial to me that they actually changed it to the Gruffalo. I can understand why, but... Come on, Bu Things Bubble Works change, isn't it? awesome. Well, yeah. it's like, you know, Charlie and Chocolate Factory and all that around the world in the 80s and stuff. It all... Yeah, I things know. Things change. I get it. It's just like... It was just such a fun, like, relaxed... Uh, you know, venture for your mm. factory. It was great. That's the thing they're into. It's the memories, isn't it? That's what makes. Yeah, I think Ch Chessington more. has changed a lot, like since. I've heard that creator of Bubble X himself refused to ride the soap version. What's the soap version? That sounds like in a beef a rave, like where they put like all the foam on. <laughs> That's the after hours version. That after is. hours bubble works. Ch Chessington vibes. Chessington oh, vibes. Yeah. <laughs> Chessington vibes. Chessington vibes. That's hilarious. The ride that first got Mr. Sam Costello into theme parks. Oh, yes. The Imperial Lever. <laughs> oh, right. <laughs> Imperial Lever, the ride. <laughs> Hey Mike! Uh, oh, the Imperial Leather Bubble Works. Oh, that's what you mean. The soap version. I get it. Oh, I... We took we took it as something completely different. Yeah, we, we, we actually... That would actually be really good. Like, if people just like sprayed you down with foam. Like, because you're, you know, something went wrong in the factory or something. Have you ever been to a foam party? The lift hill. Have you not? They're really weird. <laughs> I can imagine that it just gets in your eyes, it starts stinging, you don't can't see, you fall yeah, over, it is. someone stabs you. <laughs> it is, but you it's... die. <laughs> I wouldn't go that far. Read channel horror story times. Check me out on YouTube. <laughs> I wouldn't go that far. <laughs> you die. Gets in your eyes, you fall over, that's, you that's die. That... <laughs> that's the ending of every story. You die. That's the end. <laughs> or is it? Is it? I don't know, is it? Uh, I wouldn't mind a Colossus sim just for Emily to enjoy and then have the iconic lift or sound. Yes. <laughs> Followed by the vast amount of screaming. If they were to make a sim that works, it would be better to do the original sort of a... Yeah, absolutely. I, I agree. Also, getting the IP for the Gruffalo for Ride Sims would be very, very, very difficult. Probably why we'll never see, like, Darren Brown and Gangster Granny as well. That's probably why we won't see them. So... Oh, that's not fair. Can we not call it, like... Oh. Sawn. <laughs> call it Jigsaw. <laughs> call, call it Sawn, the ride. Sawn. <laughs> Brought to you by Reed's Channel Horror Story Time. Scene. <laughs> scene Sewn <laughs> Sewn scene Yeah that would be that would be well funny Scene at Fort Park And you survive scene Scene vibes <laughs> Scene vibes Imagine if did a fury sim uh, You would go deaf every time you dispatched it because of the world's loudest lift All I want All I want is a Costa Coffee kiosk at Wicker Man sim Thank you <laughs> thank you, right? Thank you, Ride Sims. <laughs> a Costa Coffee kiosk sim. When every time you go, I'm sorry, we don't have any caramel. No. <laughs> Is that why some of the version one sims have not been released? Um, I haven't a clue. Um, I imagine it's probably one of the reasons why it's been difficult for them to release them. Um, but but all these sims have been rebuilt, redesigned from the ground up. It's got brand new architecture behind them. 
Um, we did an interview with them on our website uh, last year, and they talked about all that kind of stuff. But yeah, it's it's um it's completely different now. Um, so any sim that you do see released in Ride Sims Two is completely different. It may look kind of the same, or have the same layout, you know, idea behind it, but they are completely designed from the ground up now. And they've got really fast, <laughs> really good at it, really quick. Yes. I say this all the time, but imagine imagine how many Sims were on this like a year ago to what it is now. It's just insane. Just knocked it out of the park constantly. Oh, we've got an e-stop. Why, why is it just e-stopped? I detected his sensory fault onto e stops. Okay, there we go. Pablo. Reset. Maintenance. Yeah, lift till station platform operate. Free lift two. There we go. All good. The crowds are hurting the vampire today. Just kick it. Pablo! How many people would want a, um, a Pablo t shirt? A Pablo sim. <laughs> a Pablo sim, yeah. The, well, actually, it's you funny just... <laughs> you say that. Um, there's a game coming out called Roller Coaster Mechanic, and it's like oh, first wow. person, and you have to. Yeah, it's not realistic. Like you have to like fix <laughs> fix nuts and bolts and stuff. But you just walk like, up to the lift. I might I might kit. genuinely call the stream like a day in the life of Pablo. Like <laughs> <laughs> do a video of yeah. it where I'm like operating a ride and it just breaks down and goes Pablo. It's, it's like a dream sequence in the video. And you just end up going into the first person game. <laughs> Stop e stopping, you That'd menace. Absolute menace of a ride. Why you do this? Oh, I don't like it. Does it like car mechanic book coasters? Yeah. Hey, Sibby. Hello, Sibby. Hope you're doing well. <laughs> Vampire. Yes. I love the music of Vampire. Hmm. I can't wait to uh, metal score Vampire up. That's going to be awesome. Yeah, that's going to that would be really good actually. What are you working on now on metal score? Um at the moment I'm working on the swarm, which sounds really weird, but it's going to be the first one with vocals. Um and I'm also working on a couple of things. Uh, I'm working on Helix. And I'm working on um, Croc Drop. Because <laughs> Croc Drop's got some really cool Egyptian scales in it. So it really it, it blends itself to metal so easily. You there, Aaron? Aaron? Okay, I think Aaron's died. <laughs> but yeah, that's what I'm working on. Um, so yeah, it's good. Um, Ride Sims really does look at all the comments on these. Yeah, they do. Um, Yeah, they do. They check. They check the comments, and I talk to Ride Sims often, um, just to you know see what's going on, what's you know what's happening, um, and if they've read the comments and read the suggestions, I give them ideas what they can do. Um, we've got a great relationship with Ride Sims, and it's always a pleasure to speak to them. Um, oh, thank you. Yeah, the Helix one again. That's another soundtrack that lends itself to metal. Aaron, where are you? Uh, Pablo got me. <laughs> for kicking the, the rides. Stop um, kicking the rides. Aaron's back, okay. everyone. F in chat for Aaron, please. My, my laptop had a critical error, apparently, and I had to restart. Wow. Mm. How did the that laptop happen? I've had for a few weeks that laptop. <laughs> <laughs> what have you done to it? Uh, keep kicking it, Hunter. F, 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 F. There you go, you got some Fs in the chat. Uh, thanks. 
Can we, have, can we have some peaches in the chat, please? Thank you. Peaches, yeah. Guys, get some super chats in. We'll read them out. S -s 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 super chats. Call them Pablo chats. Uh, yeah, we're going to be doing... Um, <clears throat> towards Halloween season, we're going to be adding a membership to the channel where you will be able to um, have emojis and stuff. Been working on that quietly in the background. So, yeah. <laughs> Pineapple. <laughs> so, yeah, we're going to have a membership on the channel. Um, it's probably going to start at about, I don't know, two or three quid, four quid, something like that. And you'll get emojis to use in the live streams and different things and all kinds of stuff. 10% um, off merch. It's basically going to be like Patreon, but it's going to be easy for you guys to sign up. Because it's done through YouTube. So, yeah, hopefully you guys look forward to that. And we're going to have a lot of fun with that as well. Yeah, so we'll have... Um, so we'll have you'll have, like, access to vlogs before anyone else when they go on the channel. Um, because, yeah, the YouTube have made it really easy. You just literally click... Where, you know, like, it says unlisted and private... Uh, and public it just says members only so yeah that's really cool that like they've done that so looking into that so if you are interested in that get ready for it that's coming probably with the first scare fest it'll be fright nights first won't it mm, yes yes fright, fright nights. nights vlog yeah so we'll be doing a whole podcast that's gonna about be amazing that. i can't wait for that trip Yes, that I is. can't wait. I've never been, never been, and I'm so. I've happy. I've never been to Fright Nights, but I've been down there, and I, but I've never been to Fright Nights and done the mazes and stuff at Farp. So, this is gonna be like massive. Yes. I've done towers. I've never, I've never been to Fright Nights. I've done Scarefest so much, and I can talk about Scarefest for a very long time. Yeah, talk about uh, Scarefest about forever. The history of it and stuff—it's just awesome. Yeah. Um, but Fright Nights, I've never done, and it'll be nice to see how different it is, you know. Yeah, for sure. Uh, I'm excited. I'm excited to get in some mazes with you guys as well. That's going to be fun. Um, yes. <laughs> you go through mazes, that's going to be amazing. Yeah, I, see, you see, right, you know what? I, I always come out of them, though, and say <laughs> the same thing, like, I don't get it. <laughs> I've come out of mazes before in the past and people have been like, oh, that was amazing. And I've just been like, I don't get why you want to be scared. <laughs> but it's the same reason people go on roller coasters. Right? I don't know. I'm a massive coaster nut. You know that, right? You know yeah. how much I love well, I mean, coasters. I mean, the generalized person goes on a roller coaster, the same people. Yeah, like, for the adrenaline. Yeah, I know. Same it's things. Just, I think. I hope that doesn't happen this year i really hope i come out of the maze at, at fourth and i'm just like laughing my I head know. off really enjoying myself probably half drunk um <laughs> found some good places well, to drink at fourth so yeah it's more than half but I, <laughs> see what i get from scare movies is i just love horror and stuff as you know you but love the get... scenery and the stories and yeah yeah i go through them and i love just taking it all in and seeing some of the technical stuff you know and then i go well how have they done this as i go through i don't really get scared um, but it's nice to see see all that and just to wonder how they've done it, you know. Yeah, I'm just going to uh, add a train. I've had a, I've had a request in the chat. Ooh. I will add a train! <laughs> Merlin Maverick says, has, has my table gone again? <laughs> Jeez. Why won't it let me dispatch? Oh, it will let me dispatch. I'm just being in two. <laughs> quick, 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 quick. Add. Come on, that's clear. Station's clear. Add the train. There we go. Now, what's funny is this train's just going to stay in the brakes and just swing. Oh, I didn't swing. I've seen it do that in real life. <laughs> there we go. We got free train ops. You happy? I'm not, because it's an absolute it doesn't nightmare. Run three, it doesn't run three trains in real life. No. This isn't real life. This is not real. This is Ride Sims. Welcome to my nightmare. <laughs> emphasis on sim. Simulation. Yeah, it's a simulation. <laughs> if you try to to offer a coaster like this in real life, <laughs> they would run free trains if all free trains, all the parts, <laughs> they had all the parts for free trains. 
to make it harder. It doesn't make it harder, it just makes it more awkward. I'll get there, but where's the overhead view? <laughs> the overhead view's that one. It just makes it awkward to time. Yeah. yeah I love seeing the layouts of coasters. Yeah, it's cool, isn't it? Mm. I love it's jumping like on like Google Earth and just looking at layouts on rides, you know. Yeah, absolutely. Like, like spin, spin, Spinball's layout looks awesome, right? Yeah. From the from the overhead, but at ground just doesn't look that good in my opinion. But looking at the actual layout, it looks it looks a lot better, <laughs> which is weird. Yeah, it's very it's very um. Every ride at Towers, in my opinion, is very photogenic, on purpose. Like you can take pictures of every ride, um, but especially the horseshoe element on. Um, on Spinball, that is nice to look at. I, I love looking at that. Um, there's just loads of things, like the airtime hills on the Smiler, the, you know, the drop on Oblivion, the, 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 you know, Nemesis, the whole of Nemesis. See, 13... Everything on Wicker, man. <laughs> 13 lets, lets it down a little bit. I feel like... I know it's like, if you go down to the woods, blah, 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 it's supposed to be, you know, scary, and, and no one knows what's going on. But I feel like sometimes you should be able to see a little bit of 13. You can now. Oh, you, well, you can now. From what they've, they've cut back quite a lot. No, so but I mean, like you could actually see it running into the crypts. Like and everyone's like, oh, what's it? You know, what's it doing in that? Like that'd be cool. And also, you, you they used to have. You can see it. Yeah. They used to have the the smoking center next to where Burger Kitchen smoking center. The smoking area where <laughs> Burger Kitchen is. Um, you used to be able to see the drop and the turnaround from there, and that was always cool to just go and have a look at. Um, yeah. Watch a few coasters go down. That's how they got the press shots. Um, they got oh. a few of them from there, and then obviously they've obviously they've got press, so they've gone in onto the ride area. But if you weren't to go into ride area, that was your best place for anything to do with thirteen. Now, at the moment, the best place to see anything from is literally from the station. Like you say, you can see it just going into the crypt. But I just I don't know. Like the layout of thirteen is actually would actually be really nice, and it's really graceful, you know, to look at it. It is really smooth, really graceful, yeah. silent. Very quiet. Very uh, quiet. If you want to know more about 13, do check out. <laughs> oh, boys, just got back from Alton Towers, down in nearly two years of no coasters, and they were intense now. <laughs> yes! Welcome back. <laughs> Welcome <laughs> back to coasters and life. <laughs> uh, best themed coaster in the UK. Oh. <sighs> Saw. <sighs> nah, I think Wicker Man's better theme than Saw. I don't know, Wicker Man is good theme, but I think when you start stood outside sort of Saw, you feel more, I don't know. I feel like I'm at the edge of a lake. <laughs> I don't feel like I'm in a Saw movie, sorry I don't. I feel like they've missed out a little bit on that. Um, I, think in the, I think you're right in the queue. The swarm, the swarm, yeah, the swarm is good. Um, just the fire doesn't work, and it always, always like, yeah. always just um, lets, say, lets it down a little bit for me that the fire doesn't work on the swarm. It's a big I'd thing. I say saw wicker man. I'd say. Yeah, that's fair. Um, Valhalla. Okay. Um, yeah. Well, to be. To be seen. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I don't know what's going to happen with that thing, but. Someone just said steeple chase. Steeple chase! <laughs> I mean, it is well themed to a, to a race. I'll give it that. It definitely holds <laughs> holds true to what it's about. Wallace and Grom at the ride. That's the best coaster I've ever been on. The big one. I mean, it is big, so that is a theme. <laughs> it is. It is one. George says he's going to Alton Tower soon. Great. Hope you have a fantastic time. Um, nice. Yeah, I'm so stoked that they're still going ahead with fireworks so far this year. So excited! I love fireworks. Mm. Absolutely so, love them. I don't think Towers fireworks. What? Because we, well, we used to we used to watch them from. Um, that hill called 
Oh, but... yeah, because you used to live near there, didn't you? So, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, oh, we used to wow. go and watch it. Did you ever see the test ones? Because they do test test show, don't they? To... I can't remember, to be honest. Oh, you? man. That'd be all awesome. The, all the members at Towers kind of blend into one, and every now and then I'm able to pick one out and go, oh, I remember this one. This was this year. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've been to four. I think I've been to four different ones. Um, this will be the fifth. So, yeah. Stay at the hotel as well this time. Hello, Just Trims. Trims! How's Canada, eh? <laughs> How's Trims, eh? How's Trims, eh? Are trims, are they good, uh, eh? Linus trim tips. How you doing? <laughs> Less trims. <laughs> Bonjour. Long time support. Bonjour, Rift Monsieur Channel. Trim. <laughs> Don't do French. <laughs> It'll confuse me. <laughs> that was that was not French. That was barely anything. Oh no. Oh, oh trims dear. is gone. Oh, he's gone. <laughs> Bye, trims. Rip. <laughs> F in chat for trims. Try and get a mug like yours. I don't think that's possible, Deck. I think yours was taken with a five finger discount and then put on eBay. It's quite hot. Actually, got my Canada Wonderland opening day reservation, so I'm pretty. Yay! Finally. It's mad that you've ridden the Lost of Coaster before Canada Wonderland's opened. Do you think you'll ever get there, Luke? Where? Canada's Wonderland. Uh, maybe, yeah, that'd be a good trip. Um, that, that would actually be a good trip, I think. Have I done Labyrinth? Yes, I have. If you watch the vlog um, from Fort, it's pretty much all about that. <laughs> um, yeah, it's a two-day Fort vlog from this year that we did. We went down there, it's, it's Sam Costello's in it as well. Check it out, it's a good watch. Um, yeah, Velocicoaster does need to be in ride sims. I would love to see some more <laughs> universal rides. Like, the Hulk would be epic. The Hulk would be <laughs> awesome. Uh, if you had the Hulk and Velocicoaster, because like, they're on the same lake, it would be amazing. Hagrid's. Hagrid's is already on there. Is it? Yeah. How do I not know anything? Did you not know this? That Hagrid's is already on it? Luke, you know, I don't know anything. Oh, <laughs> that's not true. Yeah, Velocicoaster does need to hex. That's a good shout. Maverick is in Ride Sims. I think you guys need to go onto ridesims.com forward slash simulators and check what's actually on Ride Sims. There is so <laughs> many rides. Any of them rides that have insane capacity and really difficult to keep track of. But yeah, they. Are, you know what? Spinball is actually quite hard to operate. Yeah, you said that, yeah. Well, George, it's absolutely free to sign up with Ride Sims. Just go to ridesims.com and then sign up. It's absolutely free to um, play the simulators that are available. If you do want the beta sims, um, sign up to Patreon. Yeah, ten pound. What's that? Just two, uh, two costa lattes, mate. It is. It's worth the sacrifice to be able to play Beta Sims. Yes, I, I will get round to it. Don't worry. Yeah, man. <laughs> Next month. Yeah. Maybe, maybe to nine. Imagine trying to operate Top Thrill Dragster? No. Bitch. What's TD? Yeah, what's TD? Yeah, we'll Thrill be it. Yeah, yeah. Right? yeah. I, can't, I can't think of anything. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, keep arms down, head back, and hold on. Go, go, go! You must escape! Vampire. Keep your heads back. Hold on tight. You must escape. Go, go, go. A vault. Healed. 
for too long. <laughs> a vault sealed for two centuries. I love the hex. Vault sealed. I love the smell. Pounds. I love the smell in hex. It's amazing. Yeah. Honestly, you would have loved. You would have loved that go in the vault when it was just pitch black. No. Oh, audio, that would have no been nothing. nuts. Did you still I... do the do the ride sequence though? Yeah, yeah, you did the sequence, sequence if you can speak, but just no, uh, no audio, no light. It was honestly, it was phenomenal. I think people were a bit annoyed because, like I say, if you haven't been on it before, whatever, I would have been. But I was so happy. It was awesome, to be honest. Either way, it'd still be better than Impossible at Blackpool Pleasure Beach. <laughs> it was, it was totally different. You bet it were. If it was actually because pitch you... black, I think it would be like really. Well, no sound either. You can you could just barely hear the actual um, the, the ride mechanics, like you know, just barely. I wonder, but... like, be because when you operate in hex, obviously they have CCTV to look in the areas. And if you've they watched knew what any happened. of yeah, if you've watched yeah. any of the old documentaries about towers and yeah. watched any videos on YouTube, you can see how it's actually made, how it's actually done, how the common madhouse is done, and it's really clever. And how and what views the operators have and stuff, so they can see everything going on. Why on earth did it just east up the ride and restart it when he was in there? Is a bit. It was funny because nothing happened. It just stopped and then the doors opened and that that was it. There was no like any obviously there was no announcements or anything. It was just doors opened. Did the did the because there's obviously ride no, hosts in there now. Did I, they not I say expected anything? Him. No, I expected them to come out, but it looked like it, literally they didn't do anything. They didn't come out or anything. I had to, I literally said to someone, I was like, oh, it's time to leave, guys. <laughs> <laughs> literally, no one came out. I was like, they're going to come out. They're going to say, you Quickly, know. Quickly, escape through the vault. N nothing, but just open the doors. Boom. Lights didn't even come on. So I, I, I walked around. I was like, do you know there's no lights? No sound from the vault, mate. <laughs> what did they say? Oh, what did they say? Sorry. No nothing. Didn't say anything. What? Um, and, but I knew Breakdown, someone. Pablo. That, Pablo, I knew someone who was on literally the next next go. Um, yeah. And everything was fine again. Oh, why did I close the restraints? So it was. Yeah, so it, it was literally fixed in like. It was. It was just the just the ride we were on, just just the one go in the vault. But um, I, I thought it was awesome, and taking them sensory bits away from you, it was a whole different experience. Mm -hmm. Like you know. I bet it was really freaky. Yeah, really freaky, really good. Um, I reckon that. Like, I was like, oh, I wish they did things like just did a bit more, like, you know, just got rid of a lot of the lighting. It's mad stuff. though that they let it run like that. I, 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 I couldn't bring myself to do that. If I'd see it on CCTV, I'd be like, no, nope, you stop. But they're why? They've got a choice, haven't they? There's nothing. There's nothing going wrong with the mechanics. They can. They can just carry on the sequence, or they can. Emergency exit, everybody. Just open the doors, basically, bring it back to the start. Yeah. And then they don't get the ride because you know. So I, I was like, I, I was happy with it, obviously, but I'm a bit of a geek. But um, I would have probably done the same. I would like let's just when... do, just let it run the sequence, and then yeah. they don't even know because yeah. half the people in there wouldn't have known that wasn't how it was meant to be. No, That's... not at all. <laughs> yeah. That is that is and... the problem, isn't it? And I think that um. They're, they're relying on you know they're relying on a lot of people like your feedback like that will definitely get heard and it'll probably get looked into uh, it was funny because when we got off i put it on twitter i was like hey old towers <laughs> <laughs> do you know and everyone shared it so uh, <laughs> it was quite funny actually I, 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 I always find it mad that you can take bags into hex yeah, it's just how, how it works, isn't it? it yeah. You know. But that's the one thing what spoils it, I think. Sometimes I'm like, if you let bags go, because people can forget there's just a lap, there's a little bar there. Do you know what I mean? People can forget there's just like a little, little tiny bar. Yeah. If you 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 know young or whatever, you'll forget that. But taking your bag in with you and not actually moving at all, that that's going to spoil the experience for a lot of people. I think who haven't done it before. Yeah, definitely. That's gonna take the magic away, Luke. It would, um, and it, and if you just took people in, and they just went in, you know, no bags. They had like a, a bag of, bag pickup somewhere, because you you know there's enough places to do it there, isn't there? Oh uh, yeah, they've got. Loads, and but... and uh, you would just be straight in, straight on, no messing about. No, put your bag underneath your seat. No, like you're on a train. 
<laughs> it'd be yeah. on a plane, yeah. It's like, put your little hump thingy back underneath your seat, it'd be safe. It'd just be straight on, vault, sequence, boom, done. Probably it would actually help the actual throughput of the ride itself. Yeah. Tombs the poor people who paid for a fast pass. What, on Vampire? Or... No, they're not poor. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they paid for a fast no. pass. Yeah, Trims, I think you're getting the wrong end of the stick there, though. <laughs> <laughs> nah, what it is, is I, I, I yeah, the main queue is a priority for me. Fast lane can wait, because there's only going to be 58 people in a fast lane. But there's going to be 120 in, in no time. And it's broke down again. Pablo! Come on, Pablo, you need to start fixing these rides better. You've got 10 minutes to, like... George, George is saying, have you heard about the new coast coming to Cedar Point? Yes, World I record have. for most inversions. Yeah, it's How many inversions? Them. How it'll many inversions? Six, it'll be 16, won't it? Yeah, but that's just insane. It is, but... It's not be... like, right, 20 inversions. <laughs> yeah, um, why not? And then you'll just you'll just get get into the train and it'll just spin and that'll be the ride eventually. Forty <laughs> inversions. Forty. It'll be the it'll be the washing machine element that the original yeah, yeah, yeah. smiling. But that that's the whole ride. Yeah. One hundred inversions. The vomit machine. <laughs> I'm not poor. I have a PS5. No, you're not poor, and you're very lucky. <laughs> you bought one at the right time. <laughs> I think I might take the third train off. It's just causing chaos. Come on, there we go. I don't understand why it won't just go up the lift hill because it's it's I'm doing it quick enough for people to get on and off. What I, coast I, did you think of? It'll be a, it'll be a, it'll be about the guest lower, I imagine. Exactly the same. Well, oh, I hope it's an absolute clone, and they just like added a version <laughs> on the end. <laughs> Instead of the air the time shows, it's just two yeah. zero G rolls. As you go into the station, it just flips like once, oh. and like booyah! <laughs> Ta -da! <laughs> oh, I'd love that. That'd be such a yeah. <laughs> That'd be hilarious. Yeah, PS fives are like gold dust, man. Like you did well to get one of them. Very well. An RMC T Rex. An RMC T Rex with sixteen inversions will not be with an extra. Right. With an extra corkscrew, so I'm not sure if it will even happen. I don't know. I'm, I've never mm. ridden one, but I'm not a fan of the way they look. The T. Well, they're alright. Nah, they don't. Like, even do move, Jersey Devil do doesn't look like. Yeah, it doesn't. No, no, yeah, sorry, I agree with you, actually. Yeah, I don't think. It doesn't. It doesn't do it for me. It doesn't look as good as Velocicoaster or Maverick or, you know. A BNM. Not at all, not at all. But it probably rides well. But yeah, it doesn't look as good at all in the slightest. Oh, it's like a Connect coaster. Yeah, literally. Or like, yeah, it does, doesn't it? It literally looks like a Lego, like, creations. Velocitoaster, yes. They, Velocitoaster. they need to make that, I think. A universal toaster with, like, um, Velocicoaster logo on it that puts onto your bread <laughs> when it toasts. That'd be amazing. Velocitoaster! The bread is not safe. Thought Park RMC to 2020. Thought Park and never get an RMC. Give up on your dreams. Whoa! Oh. <laughs> They're never you getting an RMC. You heard it here, guys. Just give up. It'll be a B&M. <laughs> It'll be a B&M. The next ride will be a B&M, I reckon. You need more of them. And the, the fact that Chesington on them plans, it looks a lot like a BNM for the new There's coaster nothing. attraction. There's nothing stopping Thorpe getting a Raptor or something like that. It needs to be a hyper. We need we need a hyper coaster. Yeah, but I'm saying, as a cheaper alternative, which it is, yeah. even though I'm not a massive fan of the way they look, like I said, they'll probably be awesome. Oh, they just employ the team behind Velocicoaster and make their own IP about dinosaurs, and then we can have, like, Fort Park's version of Velocicoaster. That'd be good. Velocisaur. It'll be something to the Velocisaur. <laughs> That's what they should call the saw, Sin. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, guys, and welcome down to this Velocisaur live stream. Yes. <laughs> B&M Hyper for Thorpe. In your dreams. Yes. 
in my dreams. Imagine seeing that. Imagine riding that. Imagine the views. It would be epic. I, I want a proper. Especially if you get one of them like train. jet skiers. We've already yeah. got a, the, a good ghost train in this country. No, Just... I want a, I want a proper old-fashioned ghost train, like Blackpool Pleasure Beach. Actually, a clone. You want a clone? So yeah. Right. So, ooh, got to break down, Pablo. Pablo, just kick it. Let's give it a kick. Don't kick it too Where hard. Is it? <laughs> I love fault. proper ghost trains. They're awesome. They are really fun. But I want more horror IPs as well. Yeah. Like The Conjuring or something, or Insidious or something. That'd be awesome. That would be really cool. Um, we definitely like in, need more horror IPs in this. Intamin Blitz based on the uh, the Conjuring universe. I can't start that miss. I need to start Freelift 2, otherwise it's not going to let me send it round. But I can't, because... There we go. Crikey, that took a while, didn't it? Oh, the property stopped. Yes, Trims, we know. But you don't even like the dive coaster. <laughs> oh, you, was it Yukon? There was an Instagram post, Merlin Magic making account station building, planning on something, but it was huge. Yeah, I think I genuinely... So we did a stream, if you guys missed it, go and check it out. Uh, we, we did a stream, um, Chesington's Next Coaster, and I did like, this is a launched wing coaster. It was like a shuttle wing coaster, it was really cool, it was fun to do. Um, and I really do think it could work. That's not the point, Aaron. <laughs> Tim's, that is always the point. Dive coaster would be great at, at Fort, it'd fit in really well with their um, lineup. Yeah. A dueling coaster. I don't think they could hack the operations on a dueling coaster. A, yeah, a dueling dive coaster. God damn it, that would be hard. Oh, so Yukon and Baron have some projection mapping on that. Yeah, that'd be good. Yeah, that would be difficult. <laughs> really difficult. Alright guys, we're going to be wrapping the stream up very soon. So I just want to say thank you so much for joining us and uh, cheers for checking us out. If you are new to the channel, do give us a subscribe. We do stream weekly. Um, we have our own show. We, we do lots of things here at Ghost Gem. We do vlogs. We've got some nice cinematic shots and stuff. I hate the word cinematic, but we've got some nice shots coming up. We're going to have the new <laughs> website launched on July the 1st. We're going to be working with Aaron on some stuff. We're going to be, yeah. you know... We, we play BTO and all kinds of stuff and we've got probably got some actual um, some non theme park related um, simulation streams coming up at some point I want to start doing some more because like we are our slogan is the home of theme parks and simulation because we love simulations so there's a few games that have just come out on Steam that are really interesting so I'm gonna try a couple of streams out and if you guys like them cool if you don't nah, it doesn't matter um, We'll always have the theme park stuff on Coaster Gem, but I just want to do um, I just want to do some different things, you know. Be good. Yeah. Because we did truck sim in the, yeah we did truck sim in the past and everyone loved it. Like during lockdown, everyone was like buzzing about that, laughing about me yeah. crashing into a dumpster. It was a laugh. Train uh, <laughs> sim would be cool. Yeah. But yeah, let us know in the comments what simulators you'd like us to play. Um, because there's loads. There's, there's, there's millions <laughs> and it'd be nice just to mix it up every so often once a week like simulation Tuesday or something like that I don't know um, scare maze sim that'd be good that would be cool yes that would be cool but yeah for a vlog do Wicker Man all day we could do that Aaron yeah this could be done but yeah, why not? There's a Costa kiosk there. You've got like kiosk with chocolate, like halfway around. Nachos. More than halfway. <laughs> nachos. Yeah, you got nachos there, hot dogs, waffles. I could do all day there. And the toilets are really close as well, which is a big. Yeah. Lips, just put me in the queue line with some nachos. I'm fine. 
It starts the live play. stream ends when it rolls back. It never rolls back on its own. <laughs> you have to press E stop as it launches. Or yeah. I've heard if you get if you get close to the top and it's all pushed backwards at once. <laughs> Vlog delivering the infusion model to trims in Canada. If we ever get out to Canada, I I would 100% do that. I'd I'd remove. You would have to pay for first. the trip. You would. There's no way I am paying for an infusion model. I'm sorry. No, you can he, pay he, for it. He doesn't he mean. Does he mean that actual? Um, yeah, the infusion model. Yeah, the oh, one right. that. I was gonna yeah. say. Does he mean the one was actually as you go through the queue? <laughs> No, Just not that. Ye ye that's... Yeet out the case. Oh my god, that's massive. You never get that on a plane. Just take off all the trims from it first. Sim Saturday sounds good. It does, but I'm busy on Saturdays. Maybe Sim Sunday? Sunday evening? Um, that'd be cool. S Sim Monday. Sim Sunday. It sounds like an ice cream. It does. Oh, yeah, I love Sundays. Oh, do you know what I'm afraid? It's a nice banana split. Do you remember that? Banana split? Ooh. Yeah. Hang on a minute. You like you like bananas and ice cream. But you don't like pineapples on pizza. Yeah, because duh. <laughs> um, can you remember them like you used to get from the ice cream van man? Them like oyster. Ice cream things, van man. They? Yes. Yeah, them like oyster. Things. I remember They're the ice awesome. cream van man. <laughs> yes. Yeah. The ice cream van man. Van man. <laughs> them like oyster things. They used to be amazing. Mm. I like. Um, I love a good volcano. Where you have like ice cream in a cone and it's got like sherbet inside the cone. Yes. Oh, so yeah. good. Well, I've got some news for you. Kiwi you pizza is well good, lads. Try it. Kiwi pizza. No, I'd rather not, thank you. I'll give that a go. <laughs> Sounds refreshing. Sounds disgusting. Bit of kiwi. <laughs> Imagine. Yeah, I've got some news. Oh. Costa has started doing um, Costa Van Man. <laughs> what? The vans are going around different cities doing Costa. Oh, nice. Is it free? Yeah. No. <laughs> is it? Is it Eck? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was a silly question, wasn't it? Yeah, removing Waffle Meister. They removed the crepes, and that made me really sad. I love crepes. Mm. Crepes are good. You can get good yeah. crepes on Scarefest though from the vans that turn up. Oh yeah. Crepes are awesome though. I would, um, yeah. They should do that. Have you ever had a chocolate pizza? Yes. You've had one from, from Aldi or from Iceland, I think. No, from... Oh, they so good. Dom Domino's something. They did one. These Domino's. Oh, like Domino's. Yeah, yeah. I had one from Iceland and it was so good. It was like one of, one of them ginormous cookies, them hot cookies. So good. Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, man, yeah. so nice. What I realised, Papa John's, the core chocolate scrolls. Papa John's is good, Tia Pizza. Man. Yeah, chocolate scrolls, they're awesome. They're like, yeah. um, like rolled up little pizza things. <laughs> like a Swiss roll. All this food sounds weird. Trims don't not start. Let's not start that. Like, yeah, Let's you not keep, start keep, that, your, right. keep your biscuits in your, you know. <laughs> keep your maple syrup to yourself. Oh, maple syrup and bacon though. <laughs> yeah, but it's it's like Canadian bacon, mate. What's wrong with Canadian bacon? Us trims. Trims, let us know what's wrong with Canadian bacon. <laughs> <laughs> anyway guys thank you so much for joining us tonight it's been an absolute blast talking to all of you it's been nice to see some new people as well so make sure you do subscribe guys we've got a lot coming up on the channel make sure you go and follow Aaron and all his social media and check out his YouTube channel read to yes. time horror stories read to horror story time yes read to channel <laughs> horror story time read to um, channel horror story times so there you go Luke that's the one thank, thank you. you thank ice you cream, thank ice, you ice cream van man <laughs> Um, we all scream at this we're, point. We're all good. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. For now, I've been Luke. He's been Aaron. And we've been Coaster Gem. And we will see you next time. See you later.